For the latest on the World Cup, journalist Stefan Lovgren joins me live via Skype from the Luzhnik Stadium in Moscow. Good evening, Stefan. Hello, Vincent. Very happy to be with you. Yes, uh, now we ended up uh, the, the last story with actually looking at uh, the hopes, you know, the uh, fans are hoping for the best. Uh, what are the prospects for African teams at the moment? Well, um, they got better yesterday when Se Senegal beat Poland, and uh, I was at that game. And uh, after the other African teams uh, lost their opening games, uh, there was a real sense that uh, Senegal was playing for Africa. Um, a lot of I spoke with a lot of the African fans at the stadium, and some of them were from other African countries, wearing shirts and flags of of, uh, of those countries: Ethiopia, Kenya, Cameroon. And uh, they all said the same thing. We're behind Senegal because it's an African country. Uh, but uh, at the moment, uh, it looks like that's the only hope for Africa. Whatever happened to teams like Nigeria, what are people saying? <laughs> well, I wouldn't say it's the only hope. Um, I, uh, Nigeria, it's true. Nigeria did uh, lose their opening game to Croatia. And it was, uh, it was frankly, a disappointing performance that they put in. Um, but um, I did speak with some people in the Nigerian camp today, and I think there's a sense that uh, um, they, there's, a, there's a belief that they can pull things around. The, um, um, they know that they didn't play well against Croatia, but uh, uh, they will have another chance against Iceland on Friday, and um, um, I think there's an expectation that they will do better. Uh, could this end up actually being a World Cup of full of surprises? I mean, look at how Russia is performing, and then we look at teams like Germany, strong teams being, being beaten by Mexico and so many other teams that have kind of performed in a way that shows they're staggering a little bit. Uh, it is true. The big teams have stuttered a bit in the opening, uh, in the opening games. Um, France you know, just, just squeaking by uh, against Australia, and Argentina and Brazil both uh, tying uh, their games, um, and, and as you said, Germany losing to Mexico. I think, I don't think that you should draw any immediate conclusion. It is the opening game, and team, the teams are still finding their feet, but I do think there's also an, a tendency to underestimate some of the teams that are going into the World Cup, um, teams like Croatia that beat Nigeria, and I would probably put uh, Senegal in that category as well. Wow. We'll watch and uh, see what happens, Stefan. I want to thank you very much for joining us from Moscow.